Traders and technical analysts often refer to Fibonacci studies. In this video, you will learn how to add Fibonacci trend lines to TWS charts. Fibonacci trend lines may be used to help determine price support and resistance at or near certain levels. Retracements occurring at these points within a trend could be used to help determine entry and exit points for a contract. Behind this study is the work of a mathematician who popularized a number sequence that describes certain relationships. Applied to technical analysis, the theory describes how markets may be predicted to move following the end of a trend. That trend could be played out over months or years, or could be over a week. Even intraday traders use Fibonacci measurements as a trading tool. Stock prices may follow the broad market or form a trend of their own. Analysts are interested in predicting potential retracement patterns after a trend has run its course. As trends come to an end, they leave high and low price points in place. The Fibonacci technique measures the extent of the overall move, whether it is from high to low or low to high. These highs and lows are used to position the beginning and end of the trend. The start defined by 0% and the end shown as 100%. Fibonacci trend lines are easy to configure in TWS. From within a chart, right click and select Add Fibonacci Line. Click your mouse at a peak or low point in the chart and pull up or down and to the right across the chart. A series of seven colored trend lines are drawn at 0%, 23.6%, 38.2%, 50 50%, 61.8%, 76.4%, and 100%. To delete a Fibonacci series of trend lines, right click the chart and select Remove All Trend Lines. Or right click on one of the Fibonacci lines and select Remove All Fibonacci Trend Lines from the drop down menu. For more quick tips about TWS, check out our suite of short videos. Interactive Brokers fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking the button below and to the right check out our latest short videos, market color, and digital exclusives.